Hi, I'm Beth from QAC TV, and today we're here at Queen Anne's County Library. Come on inside, and we'll find out what's going on at Library Week. Hi, I'm here today with John Walden, the director of Queen Anne's County Library, and he's going to tell us about National Library Week. Hi, how are you? Good, how are you? I'm doing well. So uh, next week, April 10th through 16th, is National Library Week, um, and it's an opportunity for us to thank the customers that come in and use us regularly. We're going to have some uh, fun giveaways that week, and one of those giveaways is our uh, fun fine scratch-off tickets. So if you come in any day during National Library Week, you if you are one of those people that do get fines, not everybody does, but those that do, these uh, scratch-offs, you can get a dollar, five dollars, ten dollars or even twenty dollars off your fines. So these Definitely become <laughs> hot, hot commodities during library week and it's a way for us to uh, thank our regular customers. Um, we also want library week to be an opportunity to people to come in and rediscover the library because I think there's a lot of good stuff that we do that if you haven't been in in a few years you have no idea that we're doing it. Um, it's very hard for us to get the word out. Well good and speaking of not being in the library for a while what kind of programs and things do you have going on for someone who might not have been here for a while? Uh, we do a lot of different things. Um, I think our access to how you get to things at the library has improved. We have a, a, a great website. We do an e-newsletter that we send out every two weeks. So if you come in, give us your email. You can get our e-newsletter every two weeks. So you can see children's programming, adult programming. Um, we have a one-on-one -on -one tutor here for technology. Uh, we have a technology librarian. She will sit down with you for a 45-minute session and cover anything you want. If you're a beginner or you want to learn something um, about a uh, a device or Kindle Fire or anything like that, she would be happy to work with you on that type of stuff. Uh, we have a new mobile site, so it's easy to access the library through your phone. Um, Apple Store or the Play Store, you can go in and, and pull up our mobile app. You can search our catalog. It has our calendar of events. Um, we do a lot for kids. Our summer reading program will be coming up um, in just a couple months, so we're really excited about that. Uh, we have a program called Gale Courses, which I don't think a lot of people are familiar with. It is an opportunity that you can go online and take courses for free through the library. You just need your library card, and you can do anything from uh, web design, learning Microsoft Excel, QuickBooks. Uh, you can do digital photography. Uh, there's first aid. There's a lot of different things. Um, those courses, you can get a certificate at the end. Um, so if your employer maybe wants you to learn a new skill set or whatever, you can take the class and at the end um, when you complete the course you get a certificate that shows that you completed the course. We also have a, a large collection of DVDs so I always get around that if you want to binge watch uh, a TV show over the weekend or whatever we have great, you know, we have HBO, Showtime series, uh, House of Cards and all different things so um, and of course we have a wide selection of books as well. Okay, perfect. And if anybody wanted more information or to check out your locations, where would they find more information? Okay, uh, our website is just qaclibrary.org. Uh, so we have everything listed on there. Uh, again, if you have the mobile site, it pulls up on that as well. Um, we have the both branches. We have the Centerville branch, um, so you could call this branch, or you could call the Stevensville branch. Uh, the other thing I should mention is we've been open on Sundays uh, from 1 to 4. We started that new this year in October, and we're going to stay open on Sundays through May. Okay. And then we take a break for the summer, uh, but we will come back next fall. So that's been very popular as well. So if you can't get in during the week or our evening hours, we ha now have the Sunday hours to make it easier for people to get in. Okay. And are you guys on social media? Yes. We have uh, Facebook, uh, Instagram, Twitter, where we try to cover all those, all those angles and try to get the word out to people. So... Like I said, lots of libraries are transforming. We're doing a lot of different things. Um, we're still big about having um, books and you know for all ages, but there's a lot of other stuff going on, and we want people to realize that that's that's out there, and you can you know take advantage of those things. Well, perfect. Thanks for having us out today. Thank you.